Today we are talking about Palantir's latest contract wins. Palantir Technologies is experiencing a dip in its stock value today, despite announcing a significant new contract with Starlab Space as its exclusive provider of enterprise-wide software data management solutions. This development is noteworthy for Palantir, a prominent data analytics company, as it secures a substantial contract that could open doors to collaborations with several major companies. Starlab Space is a global joint venture involving Voyager Space, Airbus, Mitsubishi, and MDA Space. Under this new partnership, Palantir Palantir will leverage artificial intelligence technology to enhance Starlab's enterprise operations. At the moment of writing, Palantir's stock is down approximately 0.8%, which is a minor decline in what has been a remarkably strong year for the company. Throughout the year, Palantir has thrived, buoyed by a series of promising new deals, particularly in the commercial sector, which have compensated for a slowdown in contracts with the United States government. Notably, following its fourth quarter earnings report in February, Palantir's stock surged by over 30% in a single day, a gain it has managed to sustain. This robust performance has attracted considerable attention from analysts. Despite being characterized as highly volatile and priced at a premium, Argus research analyst Joseph Bonner recently initiated coverage of Palantir with a buy rating and a target price of $29. Bonner describes Palantir as a highly differentiated investment with significant potential benefits from its new artificial intelligence-driven tools. Bonner highlighted the company's strong margin expansion, which reflects the solid unit economics of Palantir's operations. He also noted that the company is meeting market expectations in terms of of margin growth and profitability. As the second half of the year approaches, supporters of Palantir are hopeful that the company will continue its upward trajectory. In addition to the Starlab deal, Palantir has secured another significant contract. The company has announced a new collaboration with the United States government's Advanced Research Projects Agency for Health. This partnership will see Palantir working alongside the agency to advance artificial intelligence and machine learning initiatives aimed at accelerating improvements in health outcomes. This involves high-potential, high-impact biomedical and health research that traditional research or commercial activities cannot achieve. Palantir will provide its AIP and Foundry software to support the agency's core operations and data infrastructure. This two-year contract is valued at $19 million. Palantir's head of health and senior vice president of federal affairs commented on the partnership, expressing honor in supporting the mission to deliver groundbreaking healthcare outcomes with the latest commercial technology. Further analysis reveals Palantir closed the most recent trading day at $25.56, indicating a decrease of 1.01% from the previous session's close. Over the past month, Palantir's shares have risen by 21.97%, outperforming the business services sector, which saw a decline of 0.21%. The upcoming earnings release from Palantir is eagerly awaited by investors with expectations of an earnings per share of $0.08, cents, marking a 60% increase from the same quarter quarter last year. Revenue predictions stand at $652.29 million, representing a 22.31% rise from the same period last year. For the entire fiscal year, forecasts indicate earnings of $0.33 cents per share and revenue of $2.7 billion, reflecting increases of 32% and 21.5% respectively from the previous year. Investors should also consider recent changes to analyst estimates for Palantir, as these adjustments often reflect shifting short-term business patterns. Positive estimate revisions are seen as indicators of optimism about the company's prospects. To capitalize on this, the Zacks Rank, a proprietary model, incorporates these changes to provide an actionable rating system. The Zacks Rank system, ranging from 1 to 5, where 1 represents a strong buying opportunity and 5 indicates a strong selling opportunity, and right now, the company currently holds a Zacks Rank of 3, which means that Palantir is a good holding opportunity. In terms of valuation, Palantir is trading at a forward price-to-earnings ratio of 78.54, indicating a premium compared to the industry average of 21.17. The company also has a price-to-earnings growth ratio of 2.93, taking into account its projected earnings growth. The technology services industry had an average price-to-price-to-earnings growth ratio of 1.41 as of yesterday's close. In summary, Palantir is navigating a dynamic landscape with notable contracts and partnerships, particularly in the commercial and governmental sectors, driving significant stock performance and analyst interest. Despite a recent minor decline in stock value, the company continues to exhibit strong growth potential, underpinned by promising earnings forecasts and strategic initiatives in artificial intelligence and machine learning. With that being said, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video.